UFC Heavyweight Division Collision. about as decorated a kickboxer as has come into this division in some time, DC. And if we get a kickboxing match tonight, he ain't losing. He is a championship-level kickboxer, a guy that can stand in the pocket and trade and kick and punch with anyone. He's constantly throwing things from as close as you can get. He's comfortable throwing leg kicks. He will drive these into your body. But it's the aggressiveness and the ability and willingness to stand in the pocket and trade that makes him truly, truly special. I think that is what separates kickboxing, the high level yeah. from everyone else. He understands distance as well as any striker in this division. Of course, that is a byproduct of a lifetime of repetitions in the kickboxing space. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, champ. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. A seven foot Kareem at the bar to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. And now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. So a more than five year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, with some differences in height and a similar reach. And now to Ladies get us and started, gentlemen, here is this Bruce is Buck. the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon is Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out arena in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 180 pounds. Fighting out of Wanaku, Hilo, Hawaii, Magic Man. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon. You've been given your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. This might be fun. Ready. So here we go with the start of this fight. I'm anxious, man. What a matchup it is, and it's going to be interesting. And it's going to be interesting to see who has the upper hand early. It's going to be difficult to find out how this plays out. by right? striker versus well-rounded fighter. Who's going to be the one that's going to control where this fight takes place? Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. Oh, nice shot to block the kick.
just out of range with that left hook. Beautiful kick. Very nice outside leg kick by him there, DC. to see if he follows it up here. He's really driving his shin into his opponent's thigh. Beating his leg up. That was a thudding leg kick. Attacking the body, now that shot blocked. Ooh, what a punch. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. And he landed the right hand there. Pretty good right hand. Oh, brutal knee to the body. Big head kick. Lands the right hand. Both guys really throwing with authority. What a body kick. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Nice punch lands over the top. Trying to go to the body here. Unable to find the target. Over and over, landing a big body kick. So a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. a glancing right hand upstairs. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. It's a big knee. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Flush right hand is true. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. May not be a bad idea to start to check some of these. He went to work the body to great effect. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Big head kick lands. He gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. Oh, how about this kicking game on full display tonight? Kick back to back, just truly mixing up the target. Sights to behold. Real nice body kick lands. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with the punch there. Accuracy at its best. Ten seconds, let's go. Oh, he hurt him bad with the jab. Sal defensively blocks the shot. I mean, he's cutting down the side with his beautiful leg. Five minutes in the books. Stop, stop, stop. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays, DC. And if you like the kicking game, that was the round for you. Yeah, I mean, he used his kicks beautifully. He managed distance, managed space, and eventually those kicks started to really take an effect on his opponent and slow him down. He has to stay the course next round. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kicks, leg kicks, body kicks. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so with fighting with his legs. Ooh, found a home for that knee. Digging kick. Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Lee. 
tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Checks that leg kick. Nice punch lands over the top. Very nice leg kick there by Lee. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. He's got a serious right punch and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. Well, he has certainly kept the punch counters busy tonight. He's landed a ton of significant strikes and clearly is winning this fight tonight. He's winning this fight going away, and it's one of those rare instances where everything comes together. Ooh, big shot lands. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one or done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, <laughs> if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand, jab. That's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Trump. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize him coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Lee gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. That is a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got him hurt very bad. Oh, here comes the kick. That one blocked by Lee. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Nice kick. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Great punch, landed with so much power. Man, the body work really starting to take its toll here. Obvious redness on that right side. Oh, nice right hand. Big power shot there. Outstanding kick there by Lee. How about that chin? Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Nice. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Straight right hand, no good. Oh, that straight punch is gonna be a real problem if they can't make the adjustment. A real problem. He needs to move his head defensively if he's gonna avoid getting hit so many times to the face. Oh man, that's a nice kick right there. He's doing a great job of landing that kick over and over again. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. Good punch, Lance. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Oh, nice hook. That was a crippling shot right there. Do it real tight. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. It might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. What a fight huh? so far. All right, so that's the end of the round. That cut on the nose, manageable earlier, not so much right now. Really, really bad. The blood flow continuing to become a factor, and you gotta think at some point, if it gets any worse, they will have no choice but to stop this fight. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that round. It was accumulation of those strikes. He 
he kept hitting it over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent. Third round underway. Big punch land. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. You wonder if the offensive fighter is going to start to get frustrated here. Most, if not all, of these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best defensive fighters in the UFC. Oh, and he lands yet another flush knee. That's going to leave a mark. And again, when you're using this length as effectively as he is here tonight, we might get a finish here in the not-too-distant future. Nice connection with a the punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. Never looked this big. Big kick land. Leg kick. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. And a nice left hand there on the inside. Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect. So fast, so accurate. And watch the ability to land anywhere. Oh! Oh, he might be out. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Look at him working and trying to shut the liver down. Just over three minutes to go. Oh, big punch land. Cable inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Judges out of it, lighten up his opponent left and right. Head kick. Nice loop and punch. Nice job to land the kick to the body there by Lee. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Would you look at the size of that bruise on his torso? Nasty. Right, throws a straight punch and lands, so that is increasingly becoming an effective weapon for him. This is one of his best strikes, and he's throwing it over and over again. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fighter a little bit. Lesson one in boxing, but hands up, chin down. Oh, high amplitude head kick! Throwing haymakers out of the exchange. that jab. Ooh, what a punch. Oh, oh, okay. oh. Nice head kick. Leading with that right punch. Kick lands. Oh, he has landed a high volume of.
of strikes in this round and really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. The striking has been on point every step of the way. Careful to not gas out, but you gotta like the output here down the stretch. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. All right, that's the end of five minutes. That's the end of the round. You see the cut on his lip, and that thing is only getting worse. Pretty nasty gash at this point in time. You know he's gonna need some sutures after the fact. The focus right now, though, keeping his head in the game. Don't think about the cut. You gotta think about getting your offense going and shoring up that defense to prevent that cut from getting any worse. All right, next round is underway, and I think my biggest takeaway in the previous round, his ability to avoid shots, right? It seemed like every time his opponent loaded up, by the time the strike got there, he was out of arms. And it was a very minimal movement. It wasn't a big movement off the center line. The opponent threw, it was maybe two inches off to the right that allowed him to be out of position from his opponent's punch, but still in position to return a strike of his own. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Changes his stance. You'll see a lot of this from this fighter. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. Back and forth we go! Oh, he landed that kick to the outside of the lead leg there, DC. He is chopping up that leg. They say chop down the tree. You beat your opponent by slowing him down first with those nice outside leg kicks. So a combination of kicks from him, and most of those found the target, DC. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. It's such a fast leg kick. Oh, big left hook there. Oh, straight right. Look at the turnover in that kick. Oh, an obvious limp there. His leg hurting for certain. to go here in round number four. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if he can follow it up. He's landed that punch over and over again. What's he gonna do to follow up? Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's gotta press him. He's gotta go chase that finish down now. And you hear the crowd react every time they come together because they understand the power that these guys are striking with. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Over two minutes to go. Oh! Can't take many of those. You better check. Oh, that's a good right hand. Switching stances here. Beautiful body kick. Doesn't take much for the redness to start. Look at the left side of his body there. Nasty. Well, no surprises. He connects once again, and that looked like it landed right on that cut. Right on the cut, and he's targeting it, right? He's looking. You can see him almost putting a laser beam on that cut and just putting his hands on it. It doesn't take much. He keeps making his split, showing his opponent that he has no mercy. Oh, nice. Nice. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Big right hook coming, it's blocked. Under a minute now to go on the round. Beautiful head kick. Powerful leg kick lands. 
45 seconds remain in the round. Able to check that kick as well. Nice punch, Lance. Oh, there he goes, attacking that lead leg to the outside. Nasty kick there. Nasty leg kick. You gotta slow down your opponent. He knew his opponent wanted to move a lot tonight. This is the first step in getting him to slow down and fight at your pace. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Beautiful leg kick thrown. Just missing on the high kick there. Nice strike. Horn sounds for the end of round four. All right, so that's the end of the round. He got some things done offensively, but defense still an issue. And as such, the cut on his lip is only getting worse. Well, I'm not sure the extent to which he has recovered, but we do see the end of the round. DC, talk us through the replay. Well, he's a tough guy. He's going to make it to the stool. He's going to survive unless you put him completely out of there. Unfortunately, he's in there with a guy that does have that ability. here, the right, then the left. Nice body kick right under the elbow. <laughs> Lee gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can wrap. What a tricky head kick. Well, missed on that one. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. Man, striking class is in session. Beautiful punch there. Great job, Lee. Whoa! He needs to start. Oh! Well, he's up, but he is hoping for certain the finish could come at any time. Trying to establish that jab once again. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Way to hide that leg kick. Oh, blocks that kick to the body. Nicely done. Right under the elbow, the body kick lands. Well, he's the taller fighter and able to land a knee to the body with relative ease there. Oh, he got that inside leg kick to the target there, DC. You don't want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. It starts to beat up the inside thigh. That is a technique you use to really slow down your opponent. Oh, great head movement there. Slips his head off the center line, and defensively, that's exactly what you're looking for. It's almost like he can telegraph when the punch is coming. And when he sees it, he just makes a slight little movement. Right or left, you got to play and avoid those shots. Man, look at his torso. That just can't feel good. Look at the size of that bruise on his body, and you gotta think his opponent is gonna continue to attack that area. That was snuck in. Nice strike. Wow. Oh, that kick is good by Lee. Nice one, two there. As effective as straight punches we've seen all night. Huge straight punch lands, and he's got to hurt very bad. Real sneaky body kick. Crowd loving it, just a gorgeous shot there to end the fight. Really just the way he drew it up. He found the opening and capitalized on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight.
All right, let's get you some replays now. Certainly a lot for our replay guys to work with in the truck. This was a clinic tonight in terms of mixed martial arts acumen in every realm of the game. A full-on display of all of his skills. He did everything in this championship winning performance. He used his wrestling. He used his elbows. He used his pace and pressure to really wear down his opponent so that he can get his hand raised. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Gaines called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 10 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee. So the celebration is on with him and his team, and rightfully so. A monumental result tonight as he gets the win by knockout. He spoke it into existence. He said over and over to anyone that'll listen.